Welcome to The Liberated Life. Get ready to free your mind, body, and spirit in business and pleasure. Now here's your host, Robin Quinn Keen. Hi everyone, welcome to The Liberated Life. We're going to start a new series for you here on The Liberated Life, and this will be unrolling over quite a few weeks. These podcast episodes will be quite short. My goal is to keep them to under 10 minutes, but I'm going to be going through a brand new card deck that I created that will be launched soon on a platform called Deckable. D-E-C-K-I-B-L-E. It's a brand new app and I believe we're about 50 days out from the final launch. So the deck is called Trigger Warning. Let your triggers transform your life. And basically the idea is imagine being triggered and allowing the emotion to teach you something about yourself. What if you could ask yourself different questions about the trigger and reveal new insights for yourself. Well, that's what these episodes are going to talk about. So there are 40 different cards that we'll go through one at a time that all start with, I feel, because you aren't your emotions. You may feel angry, but you aren't actually anger. So I'm going to pull a card and then I'm going to take you through the questions on that card and then give you some prompts so that you can go and think about how you might want to change that, transform that, transmute that, or just have a new experience with that emotion so it doesn't trigger you like it used to. All right, so I'm going to start with the first card in the deck, which is, I feel offended. Someone offended you. Think about when someone offended you. Your opportunity is to notice the feeling below offended. Was it? Disregard, disbelief, disappointment. Did you feel disrespected? Being offended comes from having your belief system challenged. So I just want you to think about when you were offended, what happened in that situation. And I want you to get specific about when you were offended because if we just generalize it, we're not going to get to the feeling beneath it. You could have felt offended when even somebody cut in front of you in line. And in that moment, the offense came from a feeling of being disregarded, or it could have been from feeling invisible. Or let's say you were supposed to meet someone for coffee and they stood you up. They didn't show up. Well, the feeling below that, if you were to dig deep below offended, is you felt disrespected. Here's another example. Someone lied to you and you were offended that they didn't tell you the truth. And below that feeling of offense could have been disbelief or disappointment. So just take a minute, pause, or do it when you're finished listening. But I just want you to think about what offended you. And then here are a few questions. And if you're someone who loves to journal, these are questions that you could use to dig a little deeper. And the first question is, what do I notice inside of me that is easily offended? I'm not gonna give you any examples of answers because they won't be yours. But what inside of you is easily offended? Second question is, am I attached to an idea or belief that I must protect? And finally, would my life improve in any way if I was willing to gently release my attachment to that belief? All right, that's it for today. Our first week doing trigger warning. And the question is, I feel offended. What is the feeling below I feel offended? All right, everybody, that's my intention for working with this card deck that will be available in just a month and a half or so. I will let you know when it is. You might want to go get the card deck for yourself if you prefer to have something in writing that you can actually look at. Second of all, just want to mention that this kind of work is what we're doing over in my new community that I've created with Suzette. Farah and Jen Snoxel from Highest Self. It is in Mighty Networks and it is called Our Table of Joy. And if you just go to OurTableOfJoy.com, you can read all about the community. We are really working 
with our community, in our community, to help people get rid of the anxiety and depression and overwhelm. And we're doing it in gentle ways with each other to help everyone have an experience of greater peace and joy in their lives. If this sounds like something you'd like to do, come on over and join us. You can get two weeks for free and check it out. We really get going here with the group in October when part of what you're paying for every month after those two weeks free is group coaching, an opportunity to get together for a kind of a mashup with everybody once a month. And we have three calls a week to support you in your personal growth and development. All right. Thanks for listening. And I'll see you on the next episode of The Liberated Life. Thanks for listening. If you enjoyed the show, please rate and recommend on Apple Podcasts, Overcast, or wherever you get your podcast. You can also get more great information at quittingculture.com.